Let's take a quick look at this Walmart Great Value Flame Broiled Mini Bacon Cheeseburgers. Very simple design. Let's take a look at the back. Some nutritional info and also ingredients. Doesn't look too bad, right? Let's put it in the oven. Wow, my bad. It's only for the microwave. So it looks like one box contains eight of these mini ch bacon cheeseburgers. Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Asian Phenom back with another exciting food review. That's right, I went back to Walmart. I was looking through the frozen food section and I saw this very sexy and new, it looks like. Great value, flame broiled, mini bacon cheeseburgers. Only $6.43. Eight in a pack, which comes to about 80 cents each. So, kind of expensive, right, for frozen food because, like, a white castle is straight from your straight from the store is like what, like, I don't know how much it costs, like 60 cents now, nowadays, somewhere around there. So, hey, seems a little bit expensive, but anyway, um, you guys saw how I prepared it. It seems like it's not, you don't bake these, you cook these in the microwave, which is kind of weird. And the instructions didn't say like, is the timing for one or two. So I read, so I basically cooked it in the microwave 43 seconds, whatever it was, for 45 seconds each individually. So they need me to be more clear on the instructions, that's for sure. Alright, so two burgers right here that you see. It comes to about 350 calories, 40 milligrams cholesterol, 510 milligrams of sodium, 15 grams of protein. So not too bad. Let's take a quick look at this. You can sh tell straight off the bat, doesn't look as good as the picture. But we'll see how it represents in taste department. You got the bun. Pretty simple looking. You got the, the patty. It looks like... A very small piece of bacon but at least there's bacon in it and some cheese which melted away so very simple looking let's see how it smells yeah it smells hey actually it smells really good I'm surprised by it it's got that got that TGI fries sliders smell to it let's give it a try shall we Wow, it actually tastes pretty amazing. I'm surprised. Sodium content is low. I believe, if I remember right, it's lower than all the other ones I've tried. And it's very tasty. The bun is soft. The meat is flavored, right? Thankfully, not too much salt. And the bacon just add a little bit of sexiness to it. I don't think I've ever seen a frozen mini bacon cheeseburger before. And Walmart definitely represented well. Let's try this other one right here, just to make sure I get, you know, a uniform taste test. Mm -hmm. Wow, I'm really overtaken by the taste. It's flavorful. Everything seems to blend in well. My only gripe is the price. I feel that it should cost around 50 cents each. So, eight times fifty cents is four bucks. It should not definitely be more than five bucks for this box, but six forty three seems kind of hefty, especially for frozen food. You guys saw what they consist of. Let me tell you, the meat is pretty proper. The bun, I just wish it was a little bit more slightly toasted. It seems too too plain. It may be like one strip of bacon on top and bottom, then it would be perfect. So on scale to 1 to 100, I'll probably give these, I'll probably give these a, hmm, a 80%, mainly because I'm kind of turned off by the price, but the taste is up there. So definitely give it a try. 
I think you guys will appreciate and like these. Hope you guys enjoy the review.